Durham police are investigating this as a drive by shooting. Two people were left with life threatening injuries. One of them is a juvenile. We want to warn you the surveillance footage we have obtained could be disturbing to some viewers. Business owners in that plaza tell me the violence is out of control. Surveillance footage shows a spray of bullets coming through the glass windows of the Subway restaurant on North Miami Boulevard. You can see the panic of employees ducking and crawling behind the counter. The owner of that restaurant, Sam Alahi, tells me this is nothing new for them. We are not feeling safe. My employee is not feeling safe. Even I cannot walk to my store. I have to walk in between 20 people. One bullet hit the soda machine and employees were left mopping up the water, flooding the business mixed with blood from the shooting. Every day I get the, you know, customer call me or sending from subway app complaining. They not feeling safe to walk to a store and we're losing a lot of business. One in here, one, two, three, four in here, two in here. Elahi counted 11 bullet holes in his windows shell casings littered the ground outside the store. Upset, scared. One man who catches the bus near this plaza is frustrated. When you live over here, you go to sleep at night and you get woke up to, you know, AKs going off, you know what I mean? Uh, people screaming out outside because they're getting, you know what I mean, hurt or something. He says the gunfire has become unavoidable. I catch public transportation, you know what I mean? And uh, I'm just basically, and I have to go to work. Durham police are looking for this vehicle you see on your screen. Witnesses described it as a dark colored older model sedan. Police are asking anyone with information about that car or this shooting to come forward. Monica Casey, WREL News in Durham.